Hey guys, welcome back to Jibber Jab Reviews. Today's show is going to be more informational in nature and really it's going to focus on the steps that you need to follow if you want to redeem a coupon code for a watch face, although the same procedures actually apply for purchasing Galaxy themes as well. Okay, so let's jump right into it. Now there's a number of ways that you may obtain a code. Perhaps it's from one of my giveaways, so it's emailed you by the developer, or perhaps I posted a Google Sheet link with the codes on it for a particular watch face. Now if you received a code through an email from the developer, then I'm going to show you a little bit later on how you can apply it directly in the Galaxy Store. But if you are picking it up from a Google Sheet, then I wanted to go through these procedures as I've had many viewers find this step a bit more confusing. Now once you have the link to the Google code list, you're going to want to open it within Google Sheets because if you simply just view it, you may have difficulty copying the code from a cell and some people have also had issues with the entire list loading. So I always recommend that you open the entire list within Google Sheets. Now once it is open, you can use the search feature by holding down the control button and then tapping on the letter F, which is actually the find command. From here, you're going to enter the country that your Samsung account is tied to, which is usually the country that you're residing in. From here, you should see a list of codes for your country, and here's where you're going to select one and copy it by using the control button and then tapping on the letter C, which is the copy command. Once you've done this, you can go back and open up your Galaxy Store app. Now once the Galaxy Store app has launched, search for the watch face that this code belongs to and then tap on the blue purchase bar in the watch face profile or on the blue down arrow if you're looking at the smaller view of the face. Now whether you receive the code from the Google Sheet list or you received a code directly from the developer via one of my giveaways, the procedure to register the code is actually the same. From here, you're going to see the Samsung checkout message pop up and this will confirm the price of the watch face. It's going to provide you with options for payment methods and it's going to allow you to redeem that coupon code. From here, you're going to tap on the use points or coupons option, then tap on the add coupon option. And from here, you're going to get a new window enabling you to enter that code. Now you can of course type this in yourself, but to reduce your frustration and to save your own sanity, I recommend that you copy and paste the code that you received into this area instead. The Samsung codes are 16 characters long, so it's pretty easy to either mistype a letter or number or to forget one completely. So always copy and paste whenever you can. Now once the code has been entered, you're going to see the option to apply the 100% discount, which will update the balance to show $0, or in other words, it is now free. Now if you don't see the price updated, then this most likely means that the code is not valid, which could be for a couple reasons. It may mean that the code you're using has already been used by someone else, or it may mean that the code has expired. Now codes can last anywhere from one day up to four weeks and this expiry date is actually set by the developer when a code is created. If the code has already been used and you grabbed it from a Google Sheet, then you may need to go back into that sheet, select and copy another code and try entering that one. Anyways, assuming that the code is valid, then you can apply the discount and purchase it and then your watch face will download to your device. And it's actually going to remain attached to your account, meaning if you change to a different Samsung smartwatch or you even reset your current watch, then you can always go back into your account area and re-download the watch faces you previously had. Okay, and here's a tip for you. The only time or reason why you may not see a previously downloaded watch face is because either Samsung or the developer removed it from the App Store. And this could happen for a number of reasons, such as the developer closing their account, or perhaps they just wanted to remove that particular watch face from their collection, or Samsung had found an issue with the watch face which goes against its terms of service, which in most cases would be because of a copyright infringement. Again, this doesn't happen very often often, but if you do notice a watch face has just suddenly disappeared from your list, then it was most likely because of one of those issues. Okay guys, that's a quick recap on how to redeem coupon codes in the Galaxy App Store. I hope this was useful for you, but if you have any issues, feel free to leave a comment down below and I will try to answer them as best as I can. Thanks again for watching and I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. I'll catch you in the next episode. Until then, take care.
Thanks again for watching our review and if you liked it then show us some love with a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and share the video with your friends because with your support it really helps me keep the channel going so I can continue to offer you guys discounts, giveaways and of course fresh content. I'll see you in the next episode. Until then, take care.